Okay. This Fireland Queen has traveled for miles on her nuptial flight, finally landing atop a sandy mound deep in the swamp. The vantage point might seem like an ideal home, but it may be short lived. This whole area is liable to flooding, and nearby rainfall is already causing the groundwater to rise. Exhausted and without her wings, the Queen is unable to move on alone. But if she can amass enough daughters in time, the colony as a whole may stand a chance. So what you're going to do is you're going to gather the food around really quickly, these two things of food, as soon as you can and as fast as you can. You need it immediately, basically. Uh, because you're going to have to fight for some aphids, and you're going to have to do it in a massive time crunch. You're going to have to be very, very fast. Why do you think I'm building units? Very, very fast. I'm wasting no time. That's what you have to worry out for, is the fact that the lands will rise. But if we can get this, we should be able to get the lower levels with the aphids that we do need. move these units out here. Oh shit. We got this little guy. Now he won't be much of a threat. Because we because we use that second perk, which increases the attack. A great blue skimmer, Liba Lula Vibrans, hunts overhead. This fantastic aerial predator shouldn't cause any trouble for the ants. That is unless it decides to land in their way. You won't have to worry about the dragonfly for a long time. Nearby creatures have already been washed out of their homes by the rising water. So do not let him intimidate you. Deposited on the shores east of the nest. As more arrive, tensions will rise. There isn't space here for everyone. reason why you put the food so close so you can just get it you can drop it off and go right back out because we are trying to get to this aphid and if we do not get it before the creatures attack we will not get it at all this colony must remain small for now food is too scarce to support greater numbers we're gonna head let the colony get into that Should be getting close. Four. There's some grubs back in here. Now what you're going to go ahead and do is you're going to smooth all of this out and build an entirely new colony in here. Now what we're going to do is move the units in there from over here. The population should be good, so I'm going to try and mass amount how many ever I can to get over there. Okay, so we're going to move. We're going to get as many as we can. We do not need them to have food along the way, or we're going to have a problem. They're going to try and go for the sticky stuff. Now, these aren't that big of a deal. They really, really aren't. But they are quite annoying, to say the least.
Unfortunately, this guy should leave us alone. I think we'll have enough for a bridge. Yep. Barely have enough for a bridge. So, let's get these aphids and let's get them the fuck out of here. Bring them back into the queen. Quick. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, man. This is a big time crunch. Let's here come the creatures and the water rises in 60 seconds. Barely got it, boys. Barely got it. But you can do it. It's, it's hard, but you can definitely do it. Now these spiders, they're going to become really annoying. That's fine. Good. You're going to be able to kill them. Okay, maybe they'll just eat your queen. The ants must protect the queen. Queen is in imminent danger, but she should be all right. The workers will make quickly work of these guys, and then we'll be back to the scheduled regular ones today. So we got the aphids working. This is good. Now that should have been seven or eight. Yep. Now what we're going to do is we're going to move these units down here. I'm going to move worker units here. You're going to... That's basically all the workers' units' jobs are going to be. It's just farming that aphid. Amongst the many other panicking creatures are larvae of the forest bombardier beetle. Already large and accomplished predators, they will hold their ground against small groups of ants. Oh, here they come. Don't know if you can tell, but I'm like sweating into my neck right now. Because I've never done this before. Well, I have, but this would be my first playthrough of playing as so much time crunched as possible. But I'm doing it mostly because I need to do it. So there's that one. Now our next mission is to grab this aphid. should have a lot of time to do it but um never underestimate right now i'm gonna build some workers here that way they can start farming that little aphid spot because that's going to become the best thing that you'll ever work on on this playthrough like that aphid farm is very very important you won't have to worry about this aphid farm at this colony for a long time. So don't worry about that one for now. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go steal this aphid. Oh, so we can't yet. The inundation has slowed. I think we need to wait for the water to rise more, which is completely fine. An opportunity to explore for food, but there are other dangers at night. Moist skinned amphibians have come out to take advantage of this. Move these nature. guys over here now. They're gonna get poked because they think that's juicy, and they're just not very smart. Now, I don't think you can get to these aphids just yet, but you can't get to that one just yet either. Oh, shit, didn't mean to do that, but it looks like you can't get to that one either. Don't worry about that stuff for now. You won't worry about this last one until the very end. I remember that one specifically. But as long as you keep farmers on this one, you should be straight for a while. Just upgrade this. This is all the fucking... Um, this is all the fire ant workers that you'll ever need. Everything else should go into the big melee guys. That is fucking creepy. Now, what you're not going to do is push down there where the frog is, because the frog is just asking for death. 
So instead, you are going to do... Hear me out. This is going to be risky. But you're putting all your guys here. Actually, wrong group of guys. Sorry. Putting your all of your guys here. Yeah. You're going to farm up into this. Now, this will open up two tunnel networks, so don't worry about it. The tunnel networks aren't as bad as you think they are. No frogs will come down here, as far as I know. But there are, like, the little tiny lizard things, wherever they are. I don't know where they're at right now, but they'll come down in here. These guys are dead. Don't worry about your food storage right now. I would say go ahead and open it up and then upgrade it. The workers have done all they can to improve these food stores. Go ahead and open up this spot up right here. Make those units move there. This whole mission is literally about climbing. That's it's and bridging. That's literally the only thing in this game or in this uh, DLC part that you're gonna have to worry about. It's just climbing over and over and over again. Now, there's lizard. Yeah, they're still there. So these guys are still annoying. Um, I don't think you can do it yet, but you could definitely probably connect to these guys and battle them, but it's really not worth it right now. And I know you can go ahead and grab that. So make sure you move your units to that aphid nest. Water will rise soon, but it's a price worth taking. And that frog's gonna be there by the time we get there, but... Good thing is, we chose Vigorous. So these guys, there's trouble. We'll send in new units, and everybody will be fine. And he's going to smack Alicious, these guys. Yeah. He will apply a heal over time. But... Oh my god, kill this thing first. Now we've got that. Now we're gonna go grab those aphids as soon as possible. Entangled on the sticky tentacle of the dwarf fungi, as it tries to struggle free, more tentacles are drawn in, drowning the victim in thick mucilage. There we go. Hopefully the water doesn't rise soon, or we could be potentially screwed. I remember uh, I was trying to connect my ants over here for an extra chance of getting their larvae, and all of my units died, about 60 of them, 70 of them. It's not a great time at the end, and that's what took so long to get my units back and where I potentially lost. Just grab these aphids. Let me take them back. Now, we can't grab that one just yet, but don't worry, we probably will soon. And don't worry, we'll be definitely trying to get that too. And I don't know, can we get this? Or do we need to wait a little while? I think we definitely need to wait a little while. Can't get that one yet either. Oh, interesting. water rises don't worry and then we'll be able to collect some more aphids now you'll be able to farm these aphids in right into the very very end so just keep that in mind if you're worried about your population not being high enough nines out of ten chance you'll be just fine okay so now what we're gonna do is barrel straight into here this may not look like a smart move, but trust me, it'll be the worthwhile move. 
water will rise, and then we'll have access to new um, things. I'm pretty sure we'll have access to this thing, actually. If I remember correctly, yes, we will. Just grab up these grubs. Oh, this is fun. This is exciting. Oh, we're not farming yet. About to bring another torrent splashing through the bog, carrying with it a slew of ill-tempered arthropods. We should probably start building another armory unit here. Way to increase the population. Now he's going to come up underground, as you can see. He'll come through him. Through somewhere. I'm not sure which one he'll come through, but he'll come through it all right. Actually, maybe he won't. So we're going to take that opportunity. Oh, are you finally going to go inside? I guess not. Nope, he did. Shit. All worker ants go and kill that son of a bitch. The, ants will fight to the, the worker ants will do fine by themselves, so don't worry. They can hold themselves. And don't worry. We'll get to this colony soon. Now we should be able to build a bridge to this thing right there. And uh, don't even think about it, there's no way you're building a bridge to that far. I don't see it ever happening. You'd have to have a lot of units to do it. There's probably someone crazy enough to do it, but... Um, I, uh... Oh, that one got completely full. That will bring our units down now that we have more aphids going. Now, I never really explored back in here. I probably wouldn't do it because the gain is just not worth it. So, probably don't do it. Um, but back in, in here is definitely the best spot to go. Oh, shit. Have some worker ants. Uh, let's take the main group into there. Alright. Move these units in. Like I said, these aphids are going to be your best friend. Well, you should probably clear this part as soon as fucking. And these guys aren't that big of a threat. Oh, you guys aren't farming it. I didn't realize. This is why you don't open this yet. Alright. Go down in here. You've mass collected all of this good stuff. The battle. Oh, shit. Well, that'll almost fuck up.
Yeah, she's all right. We did all right, honey, didn't we? Yes, we did. Okay, so now you want to expand this part out as well. Expand this part as much as you can. So we're going to build another team right there as well. There's the spraying guys. These guys will absolutely knock your force back instantly. There's nothing you can do about it. Creatures are going to attack soon. Now, I didn't farm this. You could have probably done that while I was jerking around, maybe, but it's really up to you. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade my food units. I'm going to go ahead and open up this part. That was not good. Lance, you did the most stupidest thing you could have ever done. Actually, probably not really. I've done pretty stupider. Ah. Uh, that is the biggest roach. That's like a roach, right? That's gotta be like, holy hell, that thing's big. Nice. So you move that in. Water has risen, I think. So now you can probably get that. Nope. Definitely couldn't get that thing that was. Oh, hello, buddy. Get the hell out. Let's see, you could probably attack her now. Um, without any issues. Now, you're not going to go straight into her queen. You're going to go take the aphids and then... Oh, we don't even have enough forces. Come back. Forces still need to recover. Now, I'm going to go ahead and build a little tiny group here. Now, you won't have to, but I'm going to make sure this one stays on the outside and this... I'm going to make sure one this group stays on the outside and this one stays on the inside. Night's coming out. We need those aphids as soon as possible, so if you could hurry up and replenish my units, that'd be great. Beasts have spread across the swamp. With growing numbers of amphibians patrolling the waters, the Invictus scavenging expedition will need to be well defended. We could probably get down to there, can't we? I'd say so. So if we took all of our units. Yeah, go ahead and attack them. Uh, he didn't last very long, did he? Is toxic and serves as a warning to potential predators. A colony of little black ants marooned on a smaller fraction of the mound may be reachable if the fire ants join together to bridge the gap. See, originally I thought you would be able to like join forces and they would join with you because they realize, oh, they're impending doom, and they would choose, oh, you know, another queen, but. How long does this bridge need to go?
There we go. We got it. Wow. You're a bastard, aren't you? Have the population. This is looking really good right now. Let those guys stay on the outside and we'll keep these in the for the inside in case something decides to come in. That's a problem. The ants must fight. He's already half HP. Didn't really expect that guy. But seeming how they're just dropping food and everything is going back swimmingly, this guy's going to be taken out pretty fast. That means if they can hurry their butt up. Which, again, with the vigorous thing, the trait, there'll be no match. Just like that, we're good. Ooh, man, that was close. Again, like I said, you'll build a whole new area right here. Okay, so we're completely done. So we can bring all of our forces back. This is good. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go steal these aphids. The battle has begun. Forgot about this salamander. Not gonna lie. Holy God. Well, we, we need to haul ass, first of all, so we can get these aphids, man. They don't harvest. We just need to make it across that bridge right now. Luckily, the bridges will be small. At least the second bridge will. We should be able to make it with all of our forces combined. It's 87 units, so... We just got to do it before the water rises. And yeah, I think we'll have it. Come on, baby. Sweat, man. All right, we got the aphids. Good, good. Now we can grab this. Doing up here, doing pretty good. All right, I'm gonna start working on that, on this. This will help us raid the other colony. This is vital for raiding the other colony. So what we'll do is come right back here. And we're gonna get ready for expansion. Water rises. Now we can't get to it now, but we will be able to when it rises like two more times, so don't worry. And we'll be able to grab these other aphids as well. So right now we are doing extremely well. So 
So we're going to go ahead and build into this right here. Looks like creatures are not going to rise this night. Go ahead and move those uh, worker ants over there. Get this done a lot faster. Don't worry, we'll be just fine. Okay, I want to get ready to make a new... Eh, they won't be new, but... Building a raiding party. Oh shit. Oh shit. Eh, I forgot there was one bullfrog that usually comes in. Fun times. We'll be alright. We're alright. We got it. Woohoo! Shit. Can't get to that one yet. It looks like he's dead. We're gonna go to that. Oh shit. No, 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 no. Intruders in the nest. An ant has fallen victim to your carnivorous plan. I did not know there was a way there. But this group should be able to make it. If it doesn't, we'll uh, combine a whole new group. This is why you want to split groups. You don't want to have them all go somewhere. Now, honestly, you could probably go to this group right fucking now and grab all of that. You know what? We're going to try it. Is there a fucking way game? Tell me there's a fucking... I can't get to that yet. Okay. Can't get to that one yet either. Okay, we can grab this right here, though. We still can't come here yet. That'll be with the next water rise. I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade that tile. I'm going to keep the some part of the colony in here. We won't need all of these units to grab this. Hello, dragonfly. Now we're gonna open up this one. We're gonna make another armory here. Hello, guys.
Man, they're chewing through my guys like it's nothing. And never mind, I lied. Huh. It looks to be like there's no tunnel here, which is very good. Good. Go ahead and add another. Thing here. Creatures attack. That's fine. Don't move the units here. Expand this out as well. Now it's gonna not gonna be perfect, but this size force alone will be able to let us take on the other colony. Now, we're going to go ahead, as soon as the water rises, we're going to run over there and take their aphids. Water should start to rise here soon, and then we should be able to run and grab their aphids, because these guys are all going to die. These guys are level 3, though, which is going to be a pain in the ass, but you should be okay. If he gets too hairy, we'll see. Then we can just back the fuck out. Let's move it. Now, this dragonfly will start to land here pretty soon. But if you can get the aphids and some of their larvae, even if some of... You don't even have to really get their larvae. You don't even have to get that. Just grab their aphids. Wow, this guy is really annoying. Here they come, they're going to be very angry. Should be able to get to their queen relatively fast and snatch up their larvae. And they keep hatching very fast. There we go. We got their stuff. Now that dragonfly, he's going to be landing very fast, very soon. So we're going to take this spot right here, and then we're probably going to bounce. Do not take any of the small stuff. Okay, we're going to grab the rest of this, and then it's time to go. You don't have any more units. Shit. Get the fuck out of there. Don't tell me you're taking down my bridge, you little fuckers. Alright, so what you want to do is not do that. 
this upgrade. Upgrade with all your might. Now, go grab this aphid really fast before the uh, water starts to rise. Because he'll, uh, the uh, dragonfly, I think he'll attack in the morning. You want to make sure you're making, uh, make sure you're upgrading them on that three level three, so your colony can get stronger. Now I'm upgrading my worker tiles because why not? There's not enough food to feed the new brood. Now you don't need to gather them to the top of the hill. That'll be pretty far. Now I wonder what we can try and do is get this before the water starts to rise. Go, 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 go. Your colony didn't already have enough to deal with. The great blue skinner has chosen this moment to touch down right outside the nest. Unchecked, this titan of the sky will no doubt disrupt colony activities. But if the soldiers are able to bring her down, the rewards could be mighty. Like I said, we'll kill her. She'll be dead here in a few seconds. Uh, should be dead. That's not what I wanted. Sorry. Fire ants, the skin of stamina is beginning to wane. She leaps away from battle and prepares to take off. If the ants want to prevent her escape, they will need to act quickly. Honey, this thing is not escaping. strength to take off we've got her right exactly where we want her Oh, we just won. This dismemberment will follow. By joining their bodies together to form a giant raft, the fire ants were able to ferry the queen from the mound just as the nest filled with water. Their perils are not over, but they have shown great resilience and an ability to survive in this harsh environment. Wherever they land, the creatures of the swamp will quickly come to know the might of the fire. I didn't know it could end that early, so... But anyway, grab the extra food. Trust me, you'll need it for the formication challenge. Now, obviously we did that in 44 minutes. That was pretty fast regarding the first mission. Um, but don't worry. Um, I'll show you why in the second... I'll show you why you need all of this food for this formication challenge. I'll see you guys in the form of the chain. I'll see you in the challenge video. You guys take care. Have a great day. Peace.